Once you have a test project account and have logged in, the first thing you'll need to do is install and register a local agent. The test project agent is a small footprint executable that runs on your local machine and is OS agnostic, meaning that it can run on Windows, Linux, or Mac. With one click here, we can download it for the platform that we want. The agent takes care of installing and configuring all the required Selenium and Appium drivers, and it sets everything up for you in a few clicks. All you need to do is download and install this one executable, and you're ready to run test automation on any browser or device you need to using any OS that you want. The agent also keeps you up to date with the latest stable components and drivers for all devices, browsers, and platforms so that you don't need to manually manage this process anymore. So once the download is completed, we can run the installer. It uses a standard install experience, so we won't spend too much time on it. But you should be able to just click Next all the way through it, accepting all the defaults. And within a couple of minutes, you should have an entire automation environment configured for you and ready to use. After the install is completed, there's only one step left. You'll need to register the agent with your test project account. The test project agent doesn't just take care of browser and platform drivers, it also connects your local machine and devices to the shared testing repository that you have access to through your account. You'll first need to make sure that the agent is running locally. You can do that by checking in your system tray here and making sure that you see the test project agent icon there. If you don't, you can go to the search in Windows and find test project agent and start it up from there. Since it is running on this machine though, we can just go ahead and register it. So let's give it an alias here. Let's call it uh, new test agent. And then we'll click save. That creates the agent for us. And now we can click register to complete the registration process. And in a few seconds, you should see a message letting you know that you've successfully registered your agent and are ready to get started with using test project. If we go to the Agents tab, we can see that the new test agent is here. If we had other agents connected to the account, they would show up here as well. These agents could be from local or remote locations around the globe, and they would allow the entire team to collaborate on running tests. We can see by the green monitor icon that it's idle and ready for us to use. Test Project has automatically picked up all the browsers on this machine, and once we add tests, we'll be able to run on any of those browsers. We also have a mobile device connected, and you can see that it's automatically picked that up as well. And just like that, we're set up and able to start using Test Project.